Hello everyone and welcome to my Let's Plays for C3 2012. For those of you who don't know what that is, um, C3 is essentially the Mario hacking version of E3. So there's a site called Super Mario World Central um, and they hack Super Mario World hacks and other miscellaneous things um, as, as well. There's a small thread section for the others but it's mainly Super Mario World and I have done Super Mario World hacks in the past, and yeah, so I thought I'd do loads of them, providing I have time, obviously, for um, C3, or at least a few parts, and then continue on afterwards. Uh, the first one is Mario's Treasure Hunt 2, so let's get on with it, shall we? By Mao7. Ooh, what's this music? This music sounds very familiar. Also, I really like that title screen. So let's get on with it, shall we? <laughs> oh, I'm being Mario and Luigi. Yes, I am. Yes. Oh no, the treasure has been stolen. I have to go to Toad to tell him about that. Maybe he knows more about it. Maybe he does. Mario looks like he has a beard. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Okay then, I'm not going to argue that. Ooh. This music is from Pokemon Ruby Sapphire Emerald. What town is it? Is it Verdanturf? Verdanturf, maybe. Or it's the one with the giant um, shopping centre. The mall. Where you fight May. It's also got the art museum. It's one of those two. Anyway, the base. Let's go to the base first. I like um, I like when you enter a level Mario's hands to go woo. Anyway, uh, yeah. So let's go, shall we? Mario's room. Let's see what my room's like. Oh, I've got, I've got, I've got two rooms. This is clearly. I have a TV. This is clearly the best house ever. I want this house. Oh, what's this? Oh, okay, cool. Mario's secret stash of stuff, possibly, or his tutorial. Let me guess, when it's activated it sends me flying up. I knew it! Wait a minute. Oh, I thought I was going to go through the ceiling for a second. Okay. Koopa! Uh, okay, don't know how you get through there. Don't know what the purpose of that is. You can go through yellow blocks. You can't go through blue, you can go through yellow. Okay, I get it. Right. Watch the coin counter. Oh, I see! Oh, that's clever. Oh, wow, that's very clever. Interesting. Toad's house, I mean room, not house. You have fish! Oh my god! <laughs> that's so cool. What the hell? That is so creepy. Um. Hi Mario! I am currently in my own base! I left because I was afraid of that ghost appearing here in the night! <coughs> I hate that voice. <laughs> Fair enough, Toad. There's it a ghost, apparently. Where's Luigi's room? To be fair, I am playing as Luigi, so where's his room? This is two routes. One secret exit, one not secret exit. I'm gonna go to... No, I'll go to secret exit first. Boing boing! <laughs> That is an awesome name. I I want to um actually can I just read one second? Do you notice there is a key of the what the hell is wrong with Luigi? Oh dear Christ! Um, <laughs> um yeah. Do you notice there's um a key up there next to um the thing and uh, next to the level name? That's really helpful because like ghost houses I can never tell if they have secret exits. So anyone who does that with their hacks I really appreciate it. Ah, there we go. this green guy is. Binia, jump on him once to stun him and jump on him as- Oh, sorry, whoops, didn't mean to press that. Jump on him a second time to use him- Oh, okay, cool. Interesting. Jump on him from a different angle to be an idiot. Essentially. Yay. I will try my hardest not to use save states, so I can't promise anything. Oh, I think I got rid of all the um, coins I had. Uh, from the bonus thing, I think. I think it did. I see a treasure chest up there. I want the treasure chest. 
Oh my god, this hack is amazing! How the hell do I get this guy? Wait a minute, what's the death music? <laughs> Brilliant. That's quite pretty. Ah! I'm the first rule of Mario hacking that you should learn about me. I can be good, but I can be very, very terrible at the same time. Let's just see. It just depends on the way I'm feeling, really. I, I assume I'm supposed to go that way, but I want to go back because there was a thing over here. There's also a treasure chest. Oh, is that a life? Cool. That's cool. I like that. Kind of like that as well. Anything I missed? No, I don't think so. So I've got a secret exit to look for. Don't mind looking for them. They're pretty... What? I'm an idiot! Call me an idiot! <laughs> Everyone at SMW Central is going to hate me because I'm terrible at playing these games. <laughs> I did something like this about two years ago. I was planning on doing it last year as well, but I just... I didn't have time. To be fair, I can only do this, like, Saturday evening and... Um, Saturday evening and... Sunday evening and Monday evening. I'm very busy this weekend, but I'm going... I'm going to try and do as... I'm going to try and do as many as I can. I am honestly going to try my hardest. I'm terrible at timing things. Okay, there we go. That bouncing noise will become very, very annoying very, very quickly. Ah, oh, yes, this is the... One you can. Okay, I guess I'm going through here then. Oh, I see. Yes, I have to put. Oh, I see what it means. Oh, I like the midway. Midway is quite cool. Oh, I was expecting a key. <laughs> I was hopeful. Apparently, this is a um, I think 83 exit hack, which is pretty long. Um, obviously. Um, impressive though, because um, apparently. It must have been a mistake, a typo, but it said a month <laughs> that you've been working on this. Wait, this seems too good to be worked on for only a month. I mean, it seems way too good. It can't be a month, it just can't, but if it is, then you're good. <laughs> you're very good. I give you props, good sir. And jump! I wasn't actually expecting that. Actually, wait, can you go through the... No, you can't go through the wall. I've seen that in some hacks, including my own, which is a vanilla one, which I haven't released yet because of different things and reasons. I was planning on, um... Hopefully releasing it... Ah, oh, screw those, those coins aren't worth it. I was planning on releasing it this year. Um, but... For C3, but... Different things got in the way, like me being busy, and... Yeah, just different things. Wait a minute, when I died... Sorry, I know I'm wasting your time, but when I died... So I'm... Okay, I'm gonna die here then. Something appeared in the corner of the screen and stuff. I swear I did. Yeah, that thing! Up there! Why? Why did it appear for no reason? Found a glitch. You're welcome. <laughs> I saw not one secret exit. There is a list of where the secret exits are. Um, which is nice. And I might just go and get that. Because I did not see any secret exits. I will look though. Oh yes, Luigi, of course. With a with massive stubble for no reason. But yeah, um, it doesn't look like it has stubble limb game, so I suppose that's some kind of blessing. Um, yeah, I did not see a secret exit at all. So yeah, this should be interesting. I wonder where it is. Because I certainly didn't see anything. Uh, I imagine it's going to be one of those things where the key is not a key. 
at least it could be one of those things. I'm sort of hoping it's not though, because it's not that I don't like that, it's just it makes it harder to distinguish what it is I'm after, especially in the first secret exit. That was dumb. Oh well. Nah! Yeah, I'm sure the um, the Overworld theme is Verdant Turf. I'm pretty sure it's Verdant Turf. I could be mistaken, but I'm pretty sure. It's definitely Ruby Sapphire Emerald. Definitely. There's no way it's not. Is it here and I just missed it, or...? Is that a possibility? We'll soon find out. <laughs> no, not a possibility at all. At all? No? Okay. Yeah, this is interesting. Is the log the key? Is the signpost the key? What does it mean? I bet there's a very, very subtle hint which makes it very obvious as to where the key is. Either that, or I blatantly missed it earlier. One of those two. It's probably the blatantly missed thing. But, there have been times before when, you know, I've just been confused over a secret exit for a very long time because, well, they can be quite well hidden. Anyone who's played Mario Hat can know that. Oh, I wonder, actually. Ooh, wait a minute, I never went up there. You are the most annoying thing. <laughs> Thank Christ you're dead. Okay. Um, that's gonna be a pain in my ass. Saw that coming a mile off. So what's up there? Oh! Oh, I get it! Am I right in thinking something? I have, I have a f hypothesis. Knew it! I can break them! Ha 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 ha! Key! Oh, I like the key! Ha ha ha! That's what the yellow blocks are for. Right, I see. Ooh! You like Pokemon, don't you? <laughs> That's cave music from the original Pokemon. Um, Placid Swamp. I'll probably just do these two levels for this part. Ooh, what is this music? Big Dot levels always end with a mini boss fight, so collect power-ups and, and to be ready for a fight. Good luck. Thank you very much. Um, okay, so a boss fight at the end of this, eh? Better save, just to make sure. Because I'm stupid. When I'm playing Mario. I will plan. I will try and get everything. Um, my regular subscribers. Um, hopefully, you enjoy these, and hopefully, you're prepared to watch millions upon millions of Super Mario World hacks um, over the next few weeks. But in fairness, if anyone watches SSOHPKC, which, to be honest, who doesn't? I mean, he's got over 500,000 subscribers now. Um, you should know that. Super Mario World hacks are incredibly addicting, and they're also fun. So, I mean, if you if you haven't heard of any of these, like, oh, stupid, you should um, at least, like, give them a go, because they're really fun. Unless you're one of those Call of Duty fags who absolutely hates them for no reason. Um, then, go away. Uh, but, you know, no, it's... These, these hacks are really fun, and this is incredibly well made. If it's, if seriously, if it's only been a month, this has been in production, and it's, like, finished, this is incredible, but whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> um, those of you who haven't been subscribed to me for a while, uh, uh sorry, those of you, let me rephrase that. Right. Um... No, those of you who haven't been subscribed for me for a while, who haven't seen these, um, I hope you enjoy them, and enjoy. Uh, those of you who haven't seen my stuff before, hope you enjoy as well. 
I'm always welcome to new fans. Why wouldn't I be? It is an honour to entertain. I really like the um, shadow effect in water. I think that's something you can do in vanilla hacks. I have no idea how you do that, but I'm pretty sure it can be done. I'm pretty sure I've seen it before. Boss fight time. Hello, I've seen you before as a boss fight. It, it's very helpful for you move wherever I move. That was an awesome boss fight. It was incredibly easy, I'm not going to lie. Acid Swamp. Dense Forest. Okay. Oh yes, of course. I'm going to save just in case it won't let me go back, but I just want to see where this leads. Ooh, what is this music? Bonus level one. No, screw it, so this doesn't lead to anywhere else, so I'm going to do it anyway. Oh my god, Super Mario Land. Oh my god, oh my god. I haven't played Super Mario Land before, I'm not going to lie, but I, I've seen others Let's Play it, and I am very tempted to do it soon. But oh my god. You've made the Super Star Wars levels based off different games. I'm pretty sure this is the theme. Oh yes! Do 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 do! I'm loving this hack right now. I'm loving the idea because I hate being stupid. Okay. This thing is really cool. I love it. I don't know what these enemies really are. Were they in the original? I've seen a let's play of the second one and it was a pony version because ponies are awesome. Ponies are awesome. My little pony rules all. My little pony is awesome. Yes, it's so true. Do, 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 do. By the way, oh, what the hell is that? <laughs> Uh, yeah, if anyone hasn't seen My Little Pony, and, because I've had questions like this, it's like, why do you like My Little Pony? Why? why? Well, it's, it's, surely it's for girls. It's one of those things, Looney Tunes is a, like, I use Looney Tunes as an example, because it's probably the easiest I can derive to make this understandable. Looney Tunes is not meant for kids, it's meant for adults. No kid in their right mind would ever understand what the words pronoun trouble means. But, you know, it's said as a joke and it works because it's hilarious and this music isn't Super Mario Land, is it? And what is that? Was this originally Super Mario Land music? No, really? Maybe it was. Um, anyway, yeah. Uh, yeah, Pronoun Trouble was never... Looney Tunes never uh, originally meant for kids. It was meant for adults, because it did have adult humour. Um, a lot for that, and actually you can very easily see it when you play. Um, and when you play... Oh, can't speak today. When you... That enemy is a... Just a cheat, and a liar, and a scoundrel. But, um... Yeah, it's, it's never meant for, for kids, it was always meant for adults because of its adult humour, and you can tell there is adult humour within it. Um, and that's the same, like, not not within the same range, obviously, um, with My Little Pony, but there is still humour meant for older people, and since um, Lauren first um, found out about the fanbase, they've actually done stuff to cater for the fanbase, like adding Derpy Hooves, um, and, you know... Um, and DJ Pony slash Vinyl Scratch. Uh, also, um, Dr. Hooves, they gave um, him a bow tie. Just thought I'd throw that out there because that is awesome. Um, they, made, um, they made Dr. Hooves Matt Smith, essentially, which is pretty cool. Let's, let's be honest here. Whoa, 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 my god, that's trippy. <laughs> okay. I wonder. Okay, no I don't. Oh, uh -huh. Yeah, that's incredibly trippy. Whoa, I like the piranha plants in this game. I also like the munchers, albeit they're quite, quite creepy, but, you know, I still like them. Curse you. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting I fall through yellow blocks. So yeah, 
my opening does have, like, sort of adult humour within it. I think probably the best example is what I can think of right now. Episode 3 of Season 2, um, because uh, Twilight Sparkle literally goes insane, and I do mean literally. It's not like, oh, are you sure? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I'm sure. <laughs> Oh, okay. I assume that's how you're meant to do it? How did you do this with the trees, anyway? It's very clever. I Seriously, I've no idea how you do, like, um, custom stuff at all. I tried figuring it out, I just couldn't work it out at all. I'm sure it's very simple, and the last time I did it was when I was, like, 14, so that's probably why. But, and I'm now 18, so, you know, I've grown a lot. So that's probably why I didn't understand it back then, and I probably would now, but the point still stands. I imagine pretty much every level of this hack, I'm going to ask you what the music is, because <laughs> it's stuff I've never heard. Or at least it's a lot, a lot of it I haven't heard before. Luigi's turn. Ah, I better go the other way now, because it's incredibly loud. 